Welcome back, everybody. Happy to have you here for game number two. Apologies for a little bit of a delay. We were having a couple of client issues, but a big thank you to everybody on the analyst desk for being able to entertain us in the meantime, because I would have just read Skarner lore. That's true. Well, that actually would have been pretty entertaining. Last time it was good. You did that with Kobe one time. Yeah, but you see, here's the problem. Last time we read two paragraphs of Skarner lore, which means there's only one paragraph of Skarner lore left. So we don't <laughs> really have a That's lot of That's two more paragraphs than I thought there were. So. <laughs> <laughs> well, hey, we got through it anyway. Right, and now that flash is almost back up for FBI. It means that the babysitter doesn't have to come over both days on the weekend anymore. You can still just let this lane sort of do whatever <laughs> it needs to do sometimes. The kids can just watch TV. They'll yeah, babysit exactly. themselves. Just let them watch TV, charge an iPad. They'll be fine. What's the worst that could happen? You can't, you can't do Shelly dirty like that you know when you spawn exactly. Shelly in base it's like the walk of shame it's yeah embarrassing poor Shelly has to just be like all right I guess I'll hike 3,000 miles yeah. down the bottom people lane are ready for die. you they're just gonna poke the eye you don't even get the charge she's on the map the whole time they Come know on. where she's gonna be get it it's together. just disrespectful a good yeah. eight warrants in the area <laughs> it's just like crazy how many they have don't but... show this to your solo queue teammates they're gonna use it as a reason to say See, warrants are nothing. useless why did I buy all this useless garbage they still got the thing they Take up your inventory slots. I could have had another Doran's blade. <laughs> What's the point? It's one of those situations where, yeah, 100 Thieves are using Tenacity, but it's four out of the five of their, their traditional starters, and Tenacity maybe going to get chased down here by Kumo. Kumo's ready to go, man. He pops the ghost for the most, and Tenacity is toast. Kumo picks up a killing spree. Closer's trying to get away, and Kumo's just snipping that thing, saying, come here, buddy. Come over here. But Viego's not a team player. He was the main character of the entire last year. The dude has to be <laughs> center stage. Yeah. And it just doesn't feel like it works as well with the way Team Liquid plays the game when they're at their best. I feel like I've literally never seen this skin before because ever since it came out... The Astro Corky? Yeah, because ever since it came out, the only That's skin that one. I see for Corky is the dog one. Yeah. Everybody loves the dog. The, the butt wiggling is pretty high tier. Yeah. But as far as, like, the actual effects... This one, this does one is way slick. cooler. Like, look at the yeah. like the rocket pack on the back. Yeah, that's an, that's an S tier skin. This one's badass, but it's not a dog. Yes, all of you inevitably spamming in Twitch chat. That is Victor from Arcane. The wheels oh. just kind of fell off for CLG right there. The wheels fell off. The damn car exploded. The yeah. wheels are in the air. What on earth? That was not a good look for CLG. Yeah, there's your look goal. How close it was. Holy cow! It just immediately boom. Lots of resources being thrown at Bwipo, but he's already shot the horse! Took him out behind the shed. It's a one for one and a 1v4. Off to the glue factory for contracts, <laughs> but... I'm not gonna lie to you, man. The other night when we were playing and we got the Hextech map, I completely forgot about the ones in the base entirely. I was just running my goofy butt all the way out there like... Scorpions one. don't believe in that sort of Hextech technology. Exactly. I have a, uh... I have a moral exemption from Hextech gates. I just can't use them. Feel better with your starter. little craw creepy crawly legs on the ground? Yeah, yeah, exactly. I got my feet firmly planted. Yeah, if you're talking about a gut punch, Cloud9 has internal bleeding after that one. <laughs> Like, that was nasty. In Impact stuck inside the Cataclysm as Fudge and Blabber work together to try to deal with him. Impact's just trying to stand and fight this a little bit. Drops the W. Gwen is immune! And Fudge He's is about to learn it the hard way! I agree. I, I do think it was a really big deal, and it's, it's, it's weird. And that's, that's kind of the complexity of the game.